top. But in the men's 100, Christian Coleman is running. Christian Coleman hasn't run 100 yet this year. He's going up against my boy, uh, Browning Ro- Rohan Browning, or Browning Rohan. Sorry if I said your name backwards or forward, who I love. He was a star from the Olympics. Oh, the guy uh, with the long hair. He's the guy with the long hair, yeah. But Christian Coleman making a debut. He hasn't run 100 yet. What do you think Coleman's debut is? What should the over-under be? In the 100. Over-under. Let me tell you what the over-under should be before I tell you what I think he's going to run. Okay. You're looking up. Over-under for Christian Coleman in his 100-meter debut is going to be 9.90. That's what I was going to say. I was like, that's what he's going to do. He's going to do 9.90. Yeah, I agree. I think I'm going to take the under, too. That would certainly certainly be exciting. I mean, um, when you see Bromel running 9.75, and Coleman was better than Bromel indoors. Right, right. You got to think, all right, he can run 9.8. 9.88? Yeah. I guess I'll say 9.88. I'll go 986. I'll go 986. That'd be something. That'd be my number. Uh, here's the thing something. the Nairobi, unless, <laughs> yeah, unless Nairobi's into a headwind or it's just an uncharacteristically bad race for the two favorites, the Nairobi time is going to be so quick because yes. of the altitude. So it's going to look like those two guys are well ahead of Coleman. But all this is just leading towards towards pre. This is a great pre pre weekend. All right, time Three for another over under. Another over under. Yeah, men's four hundred. 